Hey, what's going on? I've got this Landrick Fusion model guitar, which is uh, like a Les Paul Jr. with Telecaster uh, electronics and a bolt-on neck. Uh, this guitar is uh, has a nitro finish on the body and the neck. The, this is a uh, trans white pearl color. Body is a one-piece sugar pine. Neck is solid mahogany with rosewood fingerboard. It's a 12-inch radius with 24 and 3 quarters scale. Uh, it's got this early 60s slim contour. I'm not sure what that means. Maybe this contour, which is really nice for the body or the neck. I'm not sure. Or maybe, oh, it's probably reaching. <laughs> yeah, this is contoured. Maybe that's what it means. Who knows? Um, the pickup system is a <coughs> Fishman gristle tone which has a button here that uh, kind of changes the electronics from I don't know if it's like an early 60s or, or a 50s telly to a 60s telly it sort of switches I'm not really sure but look up uh, the gristle tone from uh, Fishman uh, it's a neck bridge and the electronics here it also has, a, you have to charge it with a little tiny, like a, a phone plug here. So you charge it up. Uh, the saddles are grooved, compensated solid brass. The bridge is really cool. It's a rudders bridge with machine cold rolled steel. That's the bridge. And the saddles are grooved, compensated solid brass. Tuners are Clusen nickel vintage. Um, it's got a custom shielded cavity and pick guard, a bone nut. Uh, so it's got a nice chunky Les Paul Jr. sort of feeling neck. That again, of course, is bolt on. And uh, it just feels really nice. There's the neck pickup. Sounds a little more scooped when the button is up, when it's down. It's got a little more mid-range. Okay, I'll go back to the bridge. Yeah, when I push it in, it'd be good for a solo boost. Yeah, I like the pickups a lot. Um, here's both pickups on. So it's uh, it has a nice padded SKB case that's uh, heavy duty and included. Uh, the guitar has not been played much. It's in pretty much uh, not seeing any dings on it anywhere. Uh, looks like there's no real sign of wear on it, but it is used. We're asking a thousand dollars for it. It'd be don't really want to ship it, but um, it is listed on Reverb. If you want to find it there, then we could, you know, if you were interested, you could find it on Reverb, then I could ship it. But as far as just, uh, you know, shipping to, I don't really want to do it unless it's through uh, Reverb or eBay or something. But you can sure come pick it up if you're interested.
and that's uh, a Landrick custom guitar fusion special and it's available so thanks for checking it out very light oh yeah it weighs six pounds ten ounces